Science terms reveal fascinating concepts and principles that explain the world around us, from natural phenomena to technological wonders. Let's dive into 100 science terms. Atom is the smallest unit of matter, consisting of protons, neutrons, and electrons, forms the basis of all substances. A molecule is a group of atoms bonded together, representing the smallest fundamental unit of a chemical compound. An element is a pure substance made of only one type of atom, represented on the periodic table. A compound is a substance formed when two or more elements are chemically bonded. A cell is the basic structural and functional unit of all living organisms. Photosynthesis is the process by which green plants convert sunlight into chemical energy. DNA is the molecule that carries genetic information in living organisms. A gene is a segment of DNA that codes for a specific protein or function. A chromosome is a thread-like structure made of DNA and protein that contains genetic information. A protein is a large biomolecule made up of amino acids, essential for the structure and function of cells. An enzyme is a protein that acts as a catalyst to speed up biochemical reactions. Evolution is the process by which populations change over generations through natural selection. Natural selection is the mechanism by which organisms better adapted to their environment tend to survive and reproduce. An ecosystem is a community of living organisms interacting with their environment. A habitat is the natural environment where an organism lives. Biodiversity is the variety of life in a particular habitat or ecosystem. Matter is anything that has mass and occupies space. Energy is the capacity to do work or produce heat. Kinetic energy is the energy of an object in motion. Potential energy is the stored energy of an object due to its position or state. A force is a push or pull acting on an object. Velocity is the speed of an object in a specific direction. Acceleration is the rate of change of velocity over time. Mass is the amount of matter in an object, usually measured in kilograms. Gravity is the force that attracts two bodies toward each other, proportional to their masses. Inertia is the tendency of an object to resist changes in its state of motion. Thermodynamics is the study of heat and energy transfer. Atom economy is a measure of the efficiency of a chemical reaction in terms of waste produced. pH is a scale used to measure the acidity or alkalinity of a solution. A chemical reaction is a process that leads to the transformation of one set of chemical substances into another. A catalyst is a substance that increases the rate of a chemical reaction without being consumed. Synthesis is the process of combining simpler substances to form more complex compounds. Decomposition is the breakdown of compounds into simpler substances. Oxidation is a chemical reaction that involves the loss of electrons. Reduction is a chemical reaction that involves the gain of electrons. 
An isotope is a variant of a particular chemical element that has the same number of protons but different numbers of neutrons. An ion is an atom or molecule with a net electric charge due to the loss or gain of one or more electrons. A solution is a homogeneous mixture of two or more substances. A solvent is the substance in which a solute is dissolved to form a solution. A solute is the substance that is dissolved in a solvent. Concentration is the amount of a substance in a given volume of solution. The electromagnetic spectrum is the range of all types of electromagnetic radiation. A photon is a particle representing a quantum of light or other electromagnetic radiation. Wavelength is the distance between successive crests of a wave, often used in the context of light waves. Frequency is the number of waves that pass a given point per second. Amplitude is the maximum extent of a wave's oscillation, typically measured from its equilibrium position. Refraction is the bending of light as it passes from one medium to another. Reflection is the bouncing back of light or sound waves when they hit a surface. Magnetism is the force exerted by magnets when they attract or repel each other. Electricity is the presence and flow of electric charge. A circuit is a closed path through which electric current flows. Voltage is the difference in electric potential energy between two points in a circuit. Current is the flow of electric charge, measured in amperes. Resistance is the opposition to the flow of electric current, measured in ohms. Thermal conductivity is the ability of a material to conduct heat. Kinematics is the branch of mechanics that deals with the motion of objects without considering the forces involved. Dynamics is the study of forces and their effects on motion. Work is the energy transferred when a force is applied to an object over a distance. Power is the rate at which work is done or energy is transferred. Friction is the resistance encountered when one surface slides over another. Newton's laws are three fundamental principles that describe the relationship between motion and forces. Buoyancy is the upward force exerted by a fluid on an object immersed in it. Pressure is the force exerted per unit area on a surface. Temperature is a measure of the average kinetic energy of particles in a substance. Heat is the energy transferred between substances due to a temperature difference. A phase change is the transition of a substance from one state of matter to another. Condensation is the process by which a gas turns into a liquid. Evaporation is the process by which a liquid turns into a gas. Sublimation is the transition of a substance from solid to gas without passing through the liquid state. Deposition is the transition of a substance from gas to solid without becoming a liquid. Atomization is the process of converting a substance into tiny droplets or particles. Spectroscopy is the study of the interaction between matter and electromagnetic radiation. Tectonic plates are the large, movable plates that make up the Earth's lithosphere. 
An earthquake is a sudden release of energy in the Earth's crust, causing seismic waves. A volcano is an opening in the Earth's crust through which molten rock, gas, and ash can erupt. Climate change refers to long-term alterations in temperature, precipitation, and other atmospheric conditions. The photosphere is the visible surface of the sun. The chromosphere is a layer of the sun's atmosphere above the photosphere, visible during a solar eclipse. The core is the innermost layer of the earth, composed primarily of iron and nickel. The mantle is the thick layer of rock between the earth's crust and core. The crust is the outermost layer of the earth, consisting of solid rock. A mineral is a naturally occurring inorganic substance with a definite chemical composition. The rock cycle is the continuous process by which rocks are formed, broken down, and reformed. A fossil is the preserved remains or traces of ancient organisms. Natural selection is the process by which organisms better adapted to their environment tend to survive and reproduce. The carbon cycle is the series of processes by which carbon compounds are interconverted in the environment. The water cycle is the continuous movement of water through the environment via evaporation, condensation, and precipitation. The nitrogen cycle is the process by which nitrogen is converted between its various chemical forms in the environment. Cell respiration is the process by which cells convert glucose and oxygen into energy. Metabolism is the set of life-sustaining chemical reactions in organisms. Homeostasis is the ability of an organism to maintain a stable internal environment. Neurons are the specialized cells that transmit nerve impulses in the nervous system. Hormones are chemical messengers that regulate physiological processes in the body. Vaccination is the administration of a vaccine to stimulate an immune response. Antibodies are proteins produced by the immune system to identify and neutralize pathogens. A mutation is a change in the DNA sequence of an organism. A biome is a large ecological area on Earth's surface with distinct plant and animal groups. Photosynthetic organisms are organisms, like plants and algae, that convert sunlight into energy. Symbiosis is a close and long-term interaction between two different biological species. Thanks for watching. Kindly like, share and subscribe to our channel, Infozillion. We invite you to visit us at infozillion.com for more videos, worksheets, and flashcards.